hello, hello to each and everybody. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whatever the case may be, I do hope everybody's staying safe, everybody's staying healthy, and most importantly, I do hope that all of you are making the most out of life. You know, let's stop and smell the roses and appreciate those little things. And yes, let's just, you know, um, live life as if it's our last, all right? So yeah, guys, you asked for it and definitely you're going to get it. This is a first time reaction to this artist. Um, okay, I'm not so sure if this is the name of the artist, but I do feel, okay. <laughs> um, Pelagea, Pelagea, is that correct? Am I pronouncing it correctly? Do f feel free to correct me if I mispronounce it. That is not my intention at all, all right? Um, yes, um, Pelagea, oh, it's not the night yet. We are together. All right, uh, this was performed last June 12th of 2020. So guys, this is uploaded via the Pelagea group. So I'll be linking the link of this particular video on the description box below. You guys have been requesting for this one and I'm so excited to dive into this one because guys, never, never did you request it for something that I did not enjoy thus far, okay? So I am so like, you know, trusting. I trust that you are going to give me nothing but the best, okay? So I expect nothing but the best with regards to Paligea right here. So guys, are you ready for this? Uno, dos, tres. Let's play this. I love to watch really like live live performances. That um okay. I'm sorry. I'm talking over the the melody. But yes, I do prefer listening to artists live because there you can really tell that they are really an artist. You know, not like you know, especially in the West. Like uh, you know, um, artists does sing very exceptionally great like in studios and stuff but once they go live i mean like oh my gosh like mm -hmm. there's no there's no auditune or whatsoever in life so yeah i i do wish that people or you know whoever it is like in charge of endorsing these type of artists i just do hope that they do get artists who really are talented but unfortunately these days it doesn't really matter no more huh this is so frustrating, but nevertheless, let's, let's, you know, let's divert ourselves and our, our minds to, to whatever is happening these days. And let's just focus. This is the main goal of the channel, especially for these artists who are not, you know, signed to any label. And especially if they're just like starting their career, we are here to endorse goal enough for us reaction reactors to continuously do what we do. Because... I think it really is a lot, even if you just gain one or two, like, fans. Because, yes, at least we are doing something to kind of, like, change whatever is on the mainstream media, which I don't want to dwell into it because, you know, my take on that. Mm -hmm. So let's continue with this, guys. I hope the CCs are translating correctly, though. Her voice, man. <sighs> I'm sorry, guys, but I am having chills over chills here. I do. I don't even understand what really is the message is, but her voice. Her voice is so mesmerizing. I mean, you know, we have not heard a lot uh, of what the song is all about, really. But I'm having chills, man. I'm having chills over chills. 
her I just love the way she delivers every word of the song as if it's her last breath. You know what I'm saying? She means everything she's saying and I get that from the very start. I'm having goosebumps just by talking about it. Uh, being able to project the message of the song as if, you know, you're telling a story as if they're going to be experiencing it firsthand and this is what she's doing to me right now and it's crazy. It's less than a minute in and I'm blown away already. So, guys, your talents... I thought all along they were like in a covered like uh, concert hall or something.
О май гад. Спасибо, друзья. С праздником. О май гад. Why was I emotional there? Guys, I don't I have no idea why I got so emotional there. Because upon listening to upon reading the, the message, like the translation of what she was saying, it's not really something so sentimental, but her voice her voice it tells a totally different story. That's why I've been saying that, you know, um what's great with music is that you really don't have to understand what the message really is. It is far more uh, you know, it's far more important to be able to connect to the performer and be able, and the and the performer to be able to to translate um, the feelings that she have upon you know singing this particular song. And I don't know, I just had such a right there. I'm like, mm, it's it's it sounded so sad. It, for me, it's like you know. For me, my translation of the song, although you know the translation. I j I've seen the translation, but I'm not totally in agreement with the translation. But really, my translation, when it comes to the way she delivers it, it's more of like, you know, like a long lost love. Like she's she's waiting for this some something that she had before, but it unfortunately let go. But then now she kind of like regrets letting go of that particular love and now she's longing for it that's what i get oh my gosh and oh my golly that made me teary eyed like for real man and wow wow um that's why you know i urge you guys if you listen to this particular type of songs especially if it's like new to you or anything you try to listen to it with with you know without any prejudice whatsoever and just immerse yourself to the to the wonderful to this wonderful voice of of Palegreia, you know just immerse yourself with her voice with her message with her emotions and basically you will have a totally different perception of a particular song and i was I, if i was listening this together with a friend or anything like that i don't think i'll get this emotional you know what i'm saying um, I don't think I'll be able to truly feel what she's saying if I was like in a public place, you know, if I was listening this together with a bunch of my friends, I don't think I'll get that type of emotions. But since it's, it's kind of intimate because it's only me and her, you know, it kind of feels very, you know, private and it kind of feels more sincere. I don't know, guys, if what I'm saying here does make sense to all of you. I hope I do. But guys, I urge you to try to listen to a to a particular song without any, um, you know, disturbance from from any out, outside of your realm kind of kind of thing. Just immerse yourself with the music and immerse yourself with 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 the feelings that you get on this on a particular performance i urge you guys to take that a shot and you will have a totally different perspective on a particular song this is what i notice upon doing all of these reaction videos um guys this is not just like very you know uh, educational for me it is also very like emotionally kind of healing me as well because you know what that's what music does to all of us. It touches our hearts like no other. And wow, I just can't. But this is just wow. This is magic. That's why I keep on saying this and I'll say it once again. Music is, you know, it's just magic. It's universal. It can talk to any person, no matter what language, no matter what dialect. For as long as it connects to you, you just get the feeling of a particular performance or a particular song that they're trying to convey the message of it doesn't matter like really the language nah -uh. it is beyond that music is really is something magical and yeah i love this i love this although it got me teary-eyed but still you know in a good way in a great manner i, I guys you singers are very very like so so into character that's what i notice upon the russian artists that i've been reacting to all through this like you know this channel 
what I get from your artists is that they're very, like, you know, they're very emotional. They're very invested with their craft. And I do hope, like, the rest of the world will follow suit. Come on, guys. Um, I, I've been saying this, and I'll say it when I, once again. I don't enjoy listening to people talking nonsense, okay? Songs like this, who really does tell a lot is something that should be promoted instead of all those gibberish talking about na 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 zoo 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 like all of these like side chicks and like side hoes or all of our th all of their bling blings and all of their signature stuff that is so unnecessary and it's driving me insane for real it's driving me insane because that's what's on the radios you know so every now and then i do spare some time you know, to just listen to what's on the radios and stuff, the FM radios, and I just can't, I just can't take it. I just don't understand why they keep on playing the songs of a particular artist who is talking-ish, who is not really talking about anything. And it really frustrates me because this is what we're going to be embedding towards, the you know, the youth, and they're the... As we all know, they're our future, so whew, it's kind of frustrating, but yes, um, in my own little way, this is my way of helping, you know, helping the society and kind of be awake and, and realize things that there are a lot of things that are far more better than what they're used to listening to. Yes, yes, what do you think? Whew, I did enjoy this so much, so I'm like so really emotional still. I don't know why my heart is heavy, but nevertheless i did enjoy this i hope you did enjoy this as well and with that guys i hope you be safe let's all stay healthy and i do hope to see you all next time all right until then spasiba